But I can prove to you guys, if there's any, if there's any fence sitters, I can prove to you guys that uh, our differences make us better. And I can prove it with one story. And I'll leave you guys with this. So I used to be on this party planning committee. And one day, and one day, just looking around this committee room and I suggested what I thought we needed for our party. I was like, oh, I, I think this party needs whack-a-mole. <laughs> I stand by that. <laughs> that is how I want to party. I want to hit animatronic moles on the head with a mallet. <laughs> but I said, I think this party needs whack-a-mole. Another lady on the committee looks at me and she goes, okay, okay. I believe it's pronounced guacamole. <laughs> We see the world in a different way. <laughs> she and I. I was talking about a game you could play at Chuck E. Cheese. She was talking about a Mexican appetizer. That didn't make my life worse. It drastically improved it. <laughs> because in that moment, I got to see the world through her eyes. I got to understand how she saw me. To her, I am an adult woman who's been walking into Chipotle's for years. Just going like, oh, whack-a-mole's extra? Well, how much are jalapenos? That's who she thinks I am. And she also thinks nobody has ever told me. Like, do you get that part? We're in a room full of people. You know before she spoke up, she took a moment to look around and say, oh, oh, nobody's gonna correct this lady? Like in her own mind, in that moment, she is a hero. Just like the buck stops with me, I can Sleep well tonight! <laughs> I loved her for it.